My name is Glenn Solomon. I'm a lawyer with Offit Kerman. This is part two in my series about bankruptcy preference demands. In my last talk, I reviewed one of the most important defenses to a bankruptcy preference demand, the ordinary course of business defense. Today, I'm going to discuss other important defenses to a preference demand. First though, let's review exactly what a bankruptcy preference demand is. It works like this. Assume Company X is owed $100,000 by Company Y. Company Y then pays Company X $50,000 on May 1st, 2015. On June 1st, 2015, Company Y files for bankruptcy. One year later, on June 1st, 2016, Company X receives a letter from the trustee in Company Y's bankruptcy case. The letter demands the return of the $50,000 paid to Company X before the bankruptcy. If you receive a demand, make sure that all defenses are analyzed. The ordinary course of business defense, although important, does not always provide a total defense. There are many other defenses, including the substantially contemporaneous exchange defense. This defense works this way. If your customer pays you at the same time that you sell goods to the customer with a value at least equal to the payment, then the payment will not have to be returned. A COD transaction is a good example of this. Another often overlooked but very important defense is the new value defense, which basically allows a creditor to deduct dollar for dollar the value of services or goods provided to the customer after the date of the payment to the creditor. All of the defenses to preference cases have their own specific requirements that must be satisfied. So if you receive a demand for repayment of a preference, conduct a detailed analysis of the business history between the bankrupt company and your company. Then consult qualified legal counsel to review all of your defenses, so the amount that you are required to pay, if any, is minimized. After the analysis and review are complete, you will know the strength of your case and be in a position to decide whether to fight or negotiate a settlement. In my next video, I will discuss how you can be proactive to avoid a bankruptcy preference claim being made against your company in the first place. If you would like further information on bankruptcy preference demands, you can contact me at gsolomon at offitkerman.com or by phone at 443-738-1522. I'm Glenn Solomon with Offit Kerman.